All right, Trey, when you reflect back on the 2019 season, how would you sum it up? Uh, disappointing, obviously. Um, you know, we came in with a lot of expectations, a lot of guys work hard, put in a lot of work, sacrifice, but, uh, you know, we, it didn't come out with the results we wanted. But, uh, you know, this is a team, I guess you see that, you know, it's. We have a lot of fight on this team, so, you know, it's a positive in that, you know, and it's something that you can build on that if guys willing to fight, willing to put in the effort, um, you know, you know, we just got to capitalize a little bit more and we'll be, we'll be successful as we want to be, so. Like you said, I know you guys didn't want to finish the year with just three wins. Why do you think things turned out that way? What went wrong for this team this year? Uh, I think it was... You know, a lot of things, you know, people can point point at, but um, at the end of the day, a, a lot of games came down to finishing. Um, you know, just, you know, we was leading in just about every game. So, you know, just, just putting the team away, just, you know, I guess staying focused throughout the whole entirety of the game, I think that was, um, you know, that was one of the reasons. I mean, you know, you could point to a, a whole lot of different things, but t for me, I think that was, you know, one of the things that we could actually control that, you know, we could have helped ourselves with. How do you improve on that? How do you work on yeah. that in the off season so that you are a better yeah. finishing team next time around? Yeah, I think just the focus, the the mental uh, mental focus throughout the game, um, the the not beating yourself with penalties, uh, you know, not beating yourself with you know situations as far as not being aware or not you know. Um, just, I guess, kind of turning your focus up or turning the intensity up, you know, when it when it comes to a situation, okay, you got to have it, you know, you just got to make a play. So uh, I think with all that, just working on, you know, throughout the off season, either the competition or just, you know, whenever you come into the building, you just, you just turn your focus up mentally, physically, and um, just prepare yourself to be great for that day. And I think that's that could carry over into the season where, you know, you just got to be great this play, then the next play, then that play, and, you know, you just take it one play at a time. You were part of a defensive line that people were really excited to see yeah. at the beginning of the season. I know you guys dealt with a lot of injuries. Yeah. Why do you think that defensive yeah. line didn't end up playing up to, I know, what you guys expected yeah. it to be? Yeah, I think a lot of things, um, you know, I guess you could look at it and say uh, the, the fundamentals, the technique, you know, as far as in the beginning of the season, were kind of, you know, you know, we wasn't sharp on, we didn't, you know, a lot of, we didn't play with great pad level, uh, we didn't, you know, we wasn't tackling well, we wasn't getting off blocks and things like that, so, and I think whenever you have that in the, as a defensive lineman, um, you know, those are the things you got to harp on, you got to have great fundamentals, great technique, great footwork, and you know, I think we just, you know, throughout the season when it it kind of came around, but, you know, eventually it was a little too little too late. So it kind of, um, you know, we did, we wasn't able to uh, be as talented as, you know, show our talents because we were put in bad situations or, you know, with bad fundamentals. So. Well, it's never all bad in situations like these. So what do you feel like you guys did well this season? Um... Like I said, we fought well uh, as a team. Um, you know, we, we definitely showed our fight. Uh, we definitely know that we are one, two, three plays away from, you know, having a whole opposite season. Uh, so I think just looking upon that, we understand that we have enough talent. We have enough, um, you know, the, the scheme is right. Everything is put in place is just as far as that next level, that next notch, or just, you know, that next level of focus, next level of intensity. And then, um, you know, as far as the defensive line, um, you know, I feel as though, you know, we had a lot of young guys come in and help. We had, um, you know, so they got a lot of experience, things like that. And, you know, as far as what we've done well, you know, as far as at the end of the season, I feel as though stopping the run, you know, we, we – we improved on that, so um, like I said, that's showing that we can do it. It's just doing it every day, every down, every game. So, 
How close do you feel like you guys are to having this defense figured out? I think, it, you know, we're very close. Um, you know, like I said, it's, uh, we, we fight, we, and we was in every game, um, you know. So I think we're, you know, you show that you can do it, you show that it's possible, you show that it works when you do it right. But um, like I said, it's just about, it's a small margin in the, in the NFL between great teams and not so great teams. It's great records or not great records. So uh, we just got to close that gap. So, yeah. What would be your message to Lions fans as to reasons why there is to be optimistic about where this team is headed? Um, you know, I guess if you look at, like I said, you look at a lot of the games, uh, we two, three, four plays away from, you know, it being a whole totally different record. So, uh, you know, the the pieces are there, the scheme is there, everything's there when it when it works properly. It's just um, up to us as players to kind of make the play when it, you know, in, in a big time situation or a situation where, you know, it, it needs to happen. So, um, and we're going to work. Uh, we got a lot of workers. You got everybody in, you know, as far as in the locker room. They work hard. They, um, they fight hard. It's just, um, it's just about finishing. So, you know, that's what we're going to do throughout this off season. Just, I guess, turn that mental level up as far as the mental focus, the mental intensity, and uh, yeah. So, we got to get it right. Yeah. So. What are you personally focused on as you head into the off season? Uh, me, um, you know, just being a better overall player, uh, being, um, being a better leader, I guess, uh, you know, and, uh, just, you know, having, putting my body in a position, you know, training my body up to where, you know, I could sustain, you know, long periods, long seasons, um, you know, sustain a lot of attention from the opposition. So, you know, those are some of the things that I'm working on. So, yeah. Well, thank you so much for your time, Trey. Right. Enjoy your off season. All right, thank you.